All right, the workshop allows you to build, adjust, and remove nearby objects and structures. Uh, move between options with left and right. Press up to find the object or structure you wish to build. If your selected object appears green, press X to build it. If it appears red, try adjusting its location in yours until it changes. Screen workshop objects are built from components. When building an object, components are automatically harvested from junk items in your inventory or the workshops. What's happening right here? What are we... Are we building like a base? Can't build any generators yet. This is defense, guard posts, turrets. I think this is like a base building type deal. I think this, the sanctuary is gonna be our base and we can like build it up and do all kinds of stuff. Resources, water. We don't have any, like, scraps, though. You know what I mean? Stores. Trader. Oh, we can scrap all of this? Oh, dude. There's so much going on right now, I don't even know like where to begin. Power armor station, we probably want to keep that. We don't need mailboxes, we don't need tricycles. Alright, well, looks like we're building a base today, boys. I don't know if these street lamps are good or bad. Ruined house, we go ahead and take that. So the houses that are standing, we keep up, obviously. Logs that are on the ground. This is kind of cool. So we're gonna start with cleanup. What do we let's go take this power this power thing off. We're using our, our power cells for no reason. Alright, so we're gonna leave our power suit there. I'm gonna try to bring it all the way to our power suit station that's over here by the workshop. We just wasted all of our power walking around and stuff, but a good thing we almost made it back. So I'm gonna try to, I'm gonna set it up somewhere where I'll remember it. I thought he gave us some power cores, but I guess not. I guess, yeah, it says double zero on the power cores. So that's unfortunate. So it's right next to the station. Here we go. Let's go back to this this workshop, and we're gonna we're gonna make some sweet stuff, dude. Cooking station. I guess we'll leave that.
I just kind of want to take our time with this, dude. If we're going to be building a base that we're going to be using for the rest of the, the game, we might as well. You know what I mean? So we're going to have to build some beds. We're going to have to build some defense. We're going to need food. We're going to need water. Okay. So I think first things first, we want we want some beds for people. Does this be our like sleeping quarters? We have three beds, but why does it... This is interesting, dude. It didn't really explain what we're like doing with this, though. I'm just assuming we're building a base. Let's talk to him and see what he says. Decided to come with us. I should have listened to Mama Murphy all along. Pretty nice place she's found for us. I think we could settle down here. Make it a place to call home. What do you think? Yeah. I used to like living here. Before the war. What do you mean? Before what war? Are you saying... <laughs> I lived here over 200 years ago. I was frozen or something for most of it. Just woke up a little while ago. Damn. Like one of those old pre-war ghouls. You say you were frozen. Anybody else make it out with you? My son. Oh, I guess so, yeah. Somebody took him away while I was still trapped. I've been looking for him. Damn. I'm sorry. I hope you find him. Let me know if there's any way I can help. Anyway, I am glad you're here. I'm trying to figure this out. So I guess maybe when we saw them take my son, mind. that was after 200 years has passed. I've had word from a settlement asking for help. There's still hope in there are Minutemen out there somewhere. The only chance to start rebuilding the Minutemen is to show people that they can count on us when they need us. Trouble is, I've got my hands full here. Do you think you could go help out the settlement? I'd be glad to help. That's fantastic. The men and men could use more people like you. By the way, if you want to help out around here at all, talk to Sturgis. I'm sure he'd be glad for all the help he can get. Level up, baby. Let's go. All right, let's continue on with this. Uh, ooh, what? I just want to trade a few things. Oh. I hope you find your son. Thanks, bro. You willing to do some work? Yeah, I can. I wanna, I wanna mess with this workshop a little bit more before we do that. Do we have enough for like generators or anything now? Yeah, we have enough for a generator. This is like, it's just kind of a, a weird thing. We have enough for a big generator. Now we're gonna need water. Must oh must be placed in the water. Well, where can we find water? Oh, sweet. I think we need a generator over here too.
Nice. All right, you powered up your first object. So we have tin water. But if, are people going to be able to attack that if it's... I don't know. We'll see. I don't know how all this works. It's kind of interesting. But you know what I mean? Like, if it's if it doesn't really have good defenses, are people just going to be able to attack that at any point they want? I don't know. I also don't know if I should be taking out these trees like I am or not. But I'm going to say we put some defense right here. Workshop mode. I wanted it. Wanted to put that guard post right there. Dude, that was the perfect spot for it. We still have this big old gun. Right. Back to workshop mode. We got a bunch of steel and stuff. I guess I don't think three beds are enough. We're gonna put more beds down too. Just trying to clean up our base, man. Can't be living like this. Must assign a worker to this object before it can begin producing resources. Well, how do you assign a worker? Do you go up to it? Scrap, select, store. When the defense value is too low, the chance for attacks in your settlement increases. You should try to keep your decent size as high as some of your food and water production. Oh! Oh, so you can command her. <sighs> See if this puts our defense up. Brought it up to two. Worker already assigned a defense can produce more uh, defense. Or already sent events can work on multiple defense producing objects up to six. When you build new defense objects, existing guards will automatically assign themselves. She got assigned, right? It's working them if they're not. Uh, in the same way workers assigned to food producing objects will assign themselves to new food objects up to a maximum six food total. So we, we definitely need more defense. Traps. We need some circuitry. We move this over here. I'm gonna have, I'm gonna try to have like our water and stuff. We probably shouldn't have went for the big water rig, honestly. I went for the big water rig because I was thinking like, hey, that'll be more efficient, but. So we're cooking there. We need some food. Scavenging station, bell. Ring together nearby settlers. Um Alerts nearby settlers to danger when triggered. Oh, the fast travel arrival point? That's nice. I guess a, a bell wouldn't be bad, would it? Ring to gather nearby settlers. Just 
put a bell down right here, I guess. Fence power. I think we need more beds. Was this our bed house? It wasn't, but we can make more beds here. We got five beds, that's enough so far. Oh, that's kind of creepy. Too spooky for me. We need circuitry, dude. I want to get some... Uh... I want to get some turrets going. Turrets would be a huge help for us. Right, we need food. Happiness is up. Size is halfway. We need food. If we can get some food stuff going, we'll be all right. Potato plant. Carrot corn. We literally can't do any of this, unfortunately. We need food resources, dude. We're going to be in trouble otherwise. All right. Well, it's about the best we can do. I'll see you guys in the next episode. We're going to, uh, to talk to this guy. You willing to do some work? Sturges. I guess I can do some. I'll see you guys there.